Bob Fish, star of the band, Darts, has died at the age of 72, it has been confirmed. Bob Fish has died age 72 after battling a terrible illness. The musician was a singer in doo-wop 70s and 80s band Darts, which saw him adopt a distinctive falletto tone that he was known for throughout his career. Bob is said to have died surrounded by his family. He had his wife Heather and two daughters China and Scarlett at his side. Addressing his friend's death, Welsh broadcaster B.B. Scone told the singer remained positive throughout his battle with an unnamed illness. He said, he was a wonderful musician, from his time in chart-topping rock and roll revivalist starts, up to his recent career as a roots country performer on the autoharp. I last saw him three weeks ago after his 72nd birthday, and he was still singing well, despite his terrible illness. He stayed positive right to the end, with the support of his wife and daughters. They are three wonderful women and were the loves of his life, he added. Rock and roll band Darts were one of the most successful chart acts of the 1970s. The nine-piece British doo-wop group had 12 hit singles and 14 gold and platinum discs to their name. Based in London, Darts played a mix of original songs and revivals of early U.S. rock and roll. Former Rocky Sharp and the Razors members Den Hegarty, Griff Fender, Rita Ray and Horatio Hornblower founded the group in 1976. Ian Thump Thompson, George Curry and John Dummer joined later, before the lineup was made complete with the additions of William Hammy Howell and ex-Mickey Jupp singer Bob. Following a series of hit songs, the musicians started appearing in theatre productions in the late 1980s. Bob went on to become a world-renowned virtuoso on the auto harp and formed the White Dove duo with Ian Calford. Following the sad news of his death, fans of the star took to social media to pay tribute to the musician. Sad to hear that Bob Fish of Darts is no longer with us, one wrote. They continued, few bands brought as much excitement and energy to their allocated three minutes on top of the pops as Darts did. I love this album track and, in particular, Bob's vocals on it, they added. Another social media user wrote, in 1978 Darts were my favorite band. Rip Bob Fish. A celebration of Bob's life is taking place on Wednesday at the Pencoit Center near Cresswell Quay.